guys doing in there? Welcome back to Hoyam Outdoors. We are on the ice, as you can see, in the ice castle. It is January 27th today, and uh, we're out here for the 24-hour Canby Classic on Del Clark Lake in Minnesota. It is, what, 2.27 right now? And we have an hour and 33 minutes until we can drop our lines down. So we got stuff prepped. Got out here last night, set the house up and stayed out here. Just caught, or not just. This, like, this morning we caught one pike, that was it. Yeah. So not very ideal fishing, but there's a lot of commotion out here. This isn't our rig, that's the neighbor, so. I would guess there's probably getting close to 200 houses out here. I bought my ticket this morning and it was th number 317. Lucas bought his an hour later and it's number 360, so quite a few people coming out. You gotta get that music turned down though, we're gonna get copyright striked. We got the flag flying. Hell yeah, brother. So it's just me and Louie for the tournament here. Brad couldn't make it up. We got all of our rattle reels ready to go, rigged up with leaders on them so we don't miss any fish. And yeah, we're pretty excited to do the tournament again this year. It's always a fun time. We got some giveaway prizes here for tomorrow at the weigh-in. We're giving away two rods, two LH Customs, a GH Custom battery box with uh, Amped Outdoors was kind enough to send me out a 15 amp hour battery to put in it to give away. So go to AmpedOutdoors.com and show them some love, get a battery. That's all I use, won't go back to any other brands. So we're also giving away a couple hats. So yeah, I'm gonna quit talking here. We'll catch up with you guys when it's closer to the time when we can drop our lines in. And uh, hopefully we can win something this year. We didn't, didn't even make a video last year because we didn't catch any fish. So yeah. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Citrus Ghost Power Up down the freaking hatch. We got 16 minutes before we can drop lines here. Just got my lure choice on here. Green slash uh, Green Tiger. Green Tiger is the official name. Eighth ounce, clam, time bomb. I'm gonna jig a fat head, just the head on that. And then what we got over here is a green and chartreuse and orange, all sorts of bright colors. I don't even know what kind of lure that is. Mystery lure? Mystery lure, again. Quarter ounce. Now we got that on a leader here. The big, big, bigs. Hooked to 19 pound mono, which is on connected to fly line. Those are my two lines for the tournament here. Lucas is going to pull that rattle rail up and have that one for just the camera so I've got to try to hoist a fish up with the camera down. And then I'm going to be jigging a tungsten for small fish. Lucas is going for bluegill and perch. And I'm then, going for anything that bites. And then I'm going to have some cut bait down thanks to dad with a big old treble hook on it with a leader as well. We're getting excited here, getting a little antsy. We want to start fishing but the time will come soon enough, so you guys stay tuned. Four oh one. I just got my dead stick down here. Lucas is setting up his iFish Pro over there. Like I said, I'm starting with the clam time bomb here, dropping down. I got. There's the siren. The tournament has started. I got a, like a four inch shiner on my dead stick over there for the big mamas that are going to come through later. I'm going to go through the prize list a little bit for you guys. I'm not really sure what we're after. Walleye would be ideal because the first place walleye is a Garmin Pan Optics. So that's what we're kind of hoping for. First place crappie is a tail gator for an ice castle. So then we got far. pan fish which is like bluegill or pumpkin seed or whatever. That's a portable. First place northern is a portable. First place perch is a portable. And then there's a lot of, I think that they're paying like eight prizes per fish category. So two years ago in this exact spot, Lucas pulled out first place wall and I pulled out second place panfish. So we're gonna hope for the same outcome here. 
and uh, stay tuned. We got three cameras set up, four cameras set up, so hopefully we'll capture everything when we do catch one, if we catch one, so. Stay tuned. Stay tuned, 24 more hours. Mark in here, guys, is flying up. He did before I got the camera on. Now he's just chilling on bottom again. It's 5:25 or an hour, almost an hour and a half in here. Marking quite a few little perch. We got him on the underwater camera, but nothing, nothing to show for it yet. Got some pretty cool drone footage for you guys. Pretty good investment. Waiting for this whatever it was to come back here. I don't mar I'm not marking them anymore. Fishing in 18 feet of water under the ice. So I have her set up on a contour line. So the back of the house is in 18, the front of the house is in 15. So hopefully we get some fish to travel through. And yeah. He's gone. Probably would have caught him if I didn't reach for the camera and mess around, but it didn't look like that big of a mark anyway, so. <laughs> the price to the open until 10, ain't it, Chad? Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I love it. My cheeks just hurt. Oh, my God. Hey there. It is now 2 a.m., and I have yet to catch a fish in this tournament. Lucas and Cecilia are sleeping over there. I just got back from playing cards and drinking some apple juice, so we're going to get some sleep here. Maybe get up for the morning bite. We'll see. But I think we're going to have to fish a two hour tournament if we want to win any prizes. So, I guess stay tuned for the morning. See you then. What kind of northern wouldn't eat that? Or anything in here? Gary. There's no fish in this lake, Lou. <sighs> Unbelievable. We haven't had a bite. Oh my god, I bet that's bright. Oh god. Nice car, Cecilia. No. It's currently. 10.03 in the morning. There. So, we haven't had a bite. I'm gonna get some sleep. Yep. I think I'm gonna put on a large rattle bait to call in some northerns. Because nothing else is calling them in. That or they're just going by our baits. We had a couple big minnows on last night, a couple small minnows, some dead bait. So, we'll see what happens here. We'll either see uh, when the two hour tournament starts or when we have a bite. What are you doing? I'm gonna see if this old trick works like everyone says it does. We don't got any fun dogs. So we're gonna use spendy brats here. It's a big rig. Slide it up or what? Slide that little notch up, yep. So 
We're going to see if they like the old Johnsonville smoked brat. Oh my god. This is going to win me. Prize here. Be able to see it on bottom, probably. Get her down there. Oh, there she goes around the camera. Damn it. Fully wrapped around now. Yep. Eaters, show me your shirt. Where can a guy get one of those? Boymoutdoors.com. Right? Get yourself one. Oh my lord. Don't you have some left for you up there? <laughs> well, we're headed up to the two hour tournament here. Got my rod, got my unit, got a bucket. I got six minutes till I gotta be set up. So we're running a little bit behind, but the wind chill is 17 below right now, so it's not gonna be enjoyable. But last year, two fish were caught and the other 48 prizes were raffled. So we're gonna go give her hell here. Looks like there's at least 100 people fishing right now already. Just a little area up here. I didn't bring the big camera because the battery's gonna choke right away. This one's probably gonna too, so I hope I can get it on video if I get one. You guys gotta stay tuned for the, we're doing a couple giveaways here in a little bit. So stay tuned. <laughs> minutes left Lou and we still haven't had a bite I just went up and did the two-hour tournament and uh, didn't have a bite I stuck it out with 10 minutes to spare and got out of there came back warmed up for a few minutes went up to the weigh-in to see because there was only 15 fish caught and there's 43 prizes so they raffled the rest of them off and no nope, we didn't get anything so about 10 minutes here, we're going up to give away battery box, two LH Customs, and two hats. So we'll get that on video for you guys. Austin Hippler is going to hold the camera. So thanks, Austin. It's freaking cold out to be doing anything right now. So we still have a chance. Every All of the uh, species that there's prizes for out for the 24 hour are filled up except for walleye. First place walleye is an 18 incher, second place is seven, third place is six or six and a half, fourth place is like six. So there's four prizes that can be raffled off, I think. And then we bought raffle tickets to win some cash. So hopefully the Hoyan boys win something here, but if not, there's always next year, so. Nice jacket, Lou. Ooh, ah. Uh, what do you got there? Pissy fun, floating jacket. Nice. Dubu heated jacket. Kept me nice and warm up there, but my boots sure didn't. But I have bad circulation in my feet, so. We'll see you guys up there, and uh, I hope I hope that one of you guys watching this video won our prize. So, see you in a little bit. How'd it go, Lou? Probably one of the worst weekends I've ever had. Well, we went up there and uh, gave away five prizes, and four of them weren't subscribed, but they did. We announced four times that they needed to be subscribed to win the prizes. So thanks to those seven of you guys out of the 600 people up there that subscribed. We didn't win the live scope, so pretty good weekend. Didn't catch any fish, but... I Big announcement, guys, this is going to be our last video. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I know it was probably short and sweet. I don't know what Austin got for footage up there. He had it with his phone and he had it tilted up, so I apologize for that. We were told that we were doing the giveaway at the end of the weigh-in stuff, and he threw, threw us the microphone right away, so 
apologize we didn't get very good video of that hopefully some of it's in there but we got a lot of cleanup to do here we're staying out here again tonight but we're putting the whole covers on so if that tells you anything right lou yep gonna have some sun drops and some bush apples and i'm gonna have some bush apples and play some poker so thanks thanks for watching hopefully we can not repeat this scenario next year so Stay tuned.